This week's boiler tip, we're going to talk about hydrostatic testing on a boiler. When we open a boiler for inspection, one of the tools we can use to make sure that we don't have any leaks is a hydrostatic test. So after we've closed the water side of the boiler, we'll fill the boiler and we'll basically do a visual verification um, that we don't have any leakage at the tubes. Typically, we'll use the feed pump to pump the boiler up to at least our normal operating pressure. And we can take a look at the gauge um, when we pressurize it, give it half an hour, 45 minutes. If that pressure stays the same, we know that we don't have a leak. If we've done repairs to the boiler, it may be necessary to do a full hydrostatic test, which will pressurize the boiler to a full one and a half times its maximum allowable working pressure. In that case, we'll remove relief valves and actually may have to employ a portable hydro pump to, to attain that pressure and verify the integrity of the repairs. Two different types of leaks that we can look for are leaks at the tube sheet where the actual tube ends leak, often due to the failure of a weld or a roll. Um, in other cases, we can have pinholes or leaks within the tube somewhere in the length. That will show up as a, as a rivulet of water running out of the center of the tube. And in that case, we can usually shine a flashlight in there and see the origin of the water. 